consumption diode kit or device now we'll have to check the or draw the I versus V graph means current versus voltage graph how does the current change inside the diode PN junction diode see here in the PN junction diode is the DC output this is the voltmeter this is the emitter here both the range are given here the lower part is of milliampere range and the upper one is of microampere range so at first see here this in forward mode in forward mode the circuit connection is like that from the positive of the output dc this is the output dc with the radar these are positive terminal the negative part these are the radar black are these are negative terminal na? positive uh, radar positive terminal black are negative terminal so see here positive terminal of the output dc will be connected to the p side of the this is the p side p side this is the n side will be connected to the p side of the diode so positive of the output dc will be connected to p side of the diode it's okay again again from the n side of the diode will be connected to the positive of the emitter this is the inside and it will go to the positive of the emitter again again from the negative of the emitter it will be connected to the negative of the output dc negative of the output dc okay again from the negative of the output dc it will go to the negative of the voltmeter <coughs> from negative of the output DC it will go to the negative of the voltmeter is it okay again from positive of the voltmeter it will to the positive of the output DC positive of the voltmeter the positive of the output DC circuit connection is completed now see the this is the 0 to 3 volt range na, for forward so take it to the 3 volt this is 3 volt again this is milliampere na? so see here this is the microampere range and this is the milliampere range so we will have to take to it milliampere range okay now we have to note the value of V versus I see here See here. See here. If we move the knob, the voltage and current both both the value vary simultaneously. See here. Voltage changing, voltage is increasing means current is also increasing. See here. So for individual voltage we will have to note the value of milliampere means current suppose there is a 10 volt 10 volt so then what is the means is the 1 volt then what is the value of current means it is of 2 milliampere again for 1.5 volt see the value of current means 4 ampere 4 milliampere you can force 2 for 2 volt See the value means 6 milliampere. So in this way we'll have to note the value of voltage and current. Then after we'll have to draw the graph. And graph will be like that. For forward, this will be like that. 